Well, everybody, my next guest has been cooking since he was two. Woo! All his life. And now, at just eight, he's the star of his own YouTube channel and here to share a simple recipe that parents and kids can make and enjoy together is my buddy, Chef Logan. Yeah. What's up, Chef Logan? Not much. Well, today, Mr. Harvey, I'm going to be teaching you how to make chicken taquitos. Chicken taquitos? Yes. Okay, you, you know how to do that? Yes. We got several great kids here who like to eat. So say hello to my taste testers. Yeah. Okay, kids, are you all excited to taste Logan's food? Yeah. Show us how to start this uh, recipe. So we have two tablespoons of already heated olive oil in here. So you want to add some diced up onions. Oh, it's really hot, okay. And after you've added your diced onions, let that saute for three minutes. After it's sauteed for three minutes. You want me to do it or you go, can I do it? If yeah, you want just, to. Well, you say saute it. Yeah. I don't know how to cook, but that's what I would do. Okay. And then that's good. Okay, stop. That's good. <laughs> okay, stop. Then after it's sauteed for three minutes, okay. add some rotisserie chicken, three cups, pour that in. Then after that, you should add a pinch of salt. You can go ahead and add a pinch of salt also. Yeah, I'm gonna need a little bit more than that. Okay. I'm then put that after thing that, add like that. some fresh ground pepper. Mm-hmm. And after that, mm -hmm. add some lime juice. Lime juice. You go ahead and knock that in. You can do some too as okay, well. Okay, I'll do some too. Thank you, sir. Then you want to stir that. I'll stir that up for you, Chef Logan. And then you want it to. Get that for you, buddy. Nope. Okay, I'm sorry. Then I I'm not you can. Get that for you. It's, just... it's fine. It's yeah, fine. You just get that yourself. It's good. Then, as you stir it, you want to let it cook for one minute. Okay. Then stop. after okay. it's cooked for one minute, okay. let it cool for ten minutes. Okay. Then add. Then add your cheese. Okay. Your me Mexican blend cheese. Whoops. <laughs> Well, I just throw the rest of it in there. So she... And why we are letting it cool for 10 minutes is because if you add the Mexican blend cheese right away, it'll just melt and melt and it'll get all messy and yucky. Right. So after you've done that, okay. now you're ready to roll, Mr. Harvey. Yes, sir. Ready to roll. Okay. So let's take a corn tortilla. I should mention, they crack very easily when you roll them. So I have a solution for you. So take a corn tortilla. Okay. Soak it in warm chicken broth for 10 seconds. Take that out. Whoops. Well, that's that. That's okay. I'm gonna throw mine in there for 10 seconds. And don't do it too long or else it will disintegrate. Okay. Just, just to mention, that. and then after that, you want to add our chicken mixture. You can go ahead and take some. Okay. Put that in there like that. Okay. About one more. Okay, yes, sir. Got you, Chef Logan. Taking care of that business. You just put your hand on there. Then You'll be eating your you want to roll, roll okay. it up. Roll it. Put the seam on the bottom. Put the seam on the bottom? That's this part right here. Uh, Okay. You roll it. Just roll it. Roll it. Was, but... Okay, I got the seam on the bottom. Yes, and then um, put that in the <clears throat> oven and at 425 degrees. You want to let it Not cook both. for 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, that... at 425 degrees, 15 yes. to 20 minutes. Yes. Got gotcha. you. What yes. else, buddy? Well, then after that, you can go ahead and try one. I'll just grab my own. Oh. Okay. I'm also gonna, let's go. Oh, let's go on and try it then. That's good. Kids, let me. <laughs> okay, kids, give it a shot. Tell me what you think. Everybody put their fork down. What do you think? It's pretty good. Uh-oh, they love it. They can't stop eating. <laughs> Chef Logan. Come on, man. Good job. Hey. I wanted to get you something, man, something special. 
that inspires you to keep cooking. Let's, let's bring it on out. Yeah. Our friends at Sur La Tab love teaching kids how to cook, so they're giving Logan all 12 attachments for his KitchenAid mixer. I heard that's what you wanted. I am speechless right now. Like, this is amazing. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, that's what it is. That's because you're number one. Ladies and gentlemen, the number one YouTube chef in the country right now. And there is a kids in the kitchen cooking class with one of the resident chef at Sir La Tab. Thanks, guys. Hey, go to steveharveytv.com and you can pick up Logan's recipe. You and the kids can do it at home together. We'll be right back. <laughs>